hey y'all it's me jk welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome in today's video i'm currently at work i just finished eating my breakfast i had um half a banana nut muffin some frosted flakes and a couple of apple slices and some tea that i have right now but yeah today is wednesday may 23rd and we have two more weeks left of school one four two weeks and i'm excited okay i'm ready to get up out of here okay um <laughs> no it's kind of bittersweet um because as i am ready to get up out of here and you know sleep in a little bit during the week and stuff like that i am gonna miss my kids um and then when i come back i know i'm not gonna be with my kids they're gonna move on to second grade um and then i'll get some new babies to love and you know careful and stuff like that but i don't know i'm gonna miss them now i do have a couple of students who'll be trying me okay they'll be trying your girl okay but i'm gonna still miss them and just seeing them in the hallway is just not gonna it's not gonna be the same because i don't know but they will always be my babies and i'm also ready to get up out of here okay but yeah like i said we got two more weeks left of school 14 days um and yeah, I'm just about to do my board right now, um, update it for the day, put the agenda on there. And um, I also have to change my, it's like a nonsense word chart. I'm gonna change it, um, put some new words up there that we can practice. And then what else do I have to do? Oh, and set up my classroom for today because we're gonna watch like a little short video. I noticed some of my students are having like trouble with the R blends, like DR, BR, PR and stuff like that. So I found like a little short video on YouTube and they really like when I pull out the projector and um, they be watching a little video and they be like dancing to it and stuff. I'm like, okay, I picked a good video. It's nice and engaging and fun while they're learning. Y'all know that's my thing. But um, yeah, I gotta rearrange some of my like furniture and stuff like that so I can set it up and yeah that's what I'm about to get into but yeah I hope you all are well and stick around for this video if you like this video give this video a thumbs up and also consider subscribing to my channel I would love to have you here
Okay, so now I got my nonsense work up. That's done. Now what I'm about to do is move my room around so I can go ahead and set up the projector. And here's my projector. So when they walk in and they see the setup, they gonna already know it's gonna be, gonna be watching the video. But I keep my projector stored away um, because obviously we don't use the projector every day, but. So I usually set it up over here because on this wall over here, I pretty much outlined where the screen, where I want the screen to be. So you'll see me after I set it up. And this is pretty much how I set it up. And so then I'll move my little board over here and then I'll have like this whole little outline for the screen um, and it works really good. But yeah, I find it funny that every time that I plan to use my projector, my laptop is always dead so I always have to like charge it up. But I'm about to go ahead and move my board over and then set it up and then um, do like a little test run again just to make sure when the uh, groups come in that everything is going to be good to go. I also wanted to point out really quickly that I got this HDMI cord from Target. Oh, it's not even plugged in. <laughs> I got this from Target and it was like $8 um, because my specific projector didn't come with a um, HDMI cord. So yeah, but let me open this up. So that's what it looks like. And then I just pretty much move it to fit <laughs> accordingly because I use the same setup all the time. But I'm about to go ahead and move my board over a little bit and then I'll show you like how it looks. what my room looks like on days that I pull out the projector and we watch a little short video. Now I'm about to go ahead and head to a meeting. I have a meeting in about five minutes. So um, I'm gonna go ahead here today and then I'm gonna come back check in with you guys later. But if you are enjoying this video up until this point, give this video a thumbs up and also consider subscribing to my channel. I would love to have you here. Okay, so I just got out of my meeting. It went really well. It was just like um, collaborative planning or whatever. And I was just telling them basically like where I am with my groups. Um, EOM, which is the end of the year, or EOI, which is the end of the year. Um, so yeah, I was just telling them like I have a total of 19 students that I pull and work with. And 17 out of 19 of them are now on grade level or above. And the ones that are below only missed it according to the data by just like maybe 10 points. Um, so yeah, but we are doing really good as a team. And I just wanted to pat myself on the back because again, this is my first year in this position. And... I really love what I do. I was just telling my, um, you know, my family, like, I really love what I do. And I can tell because I have not been on Indeed. And when you have not been on Indeed to look for another job, you know it's real. Okay. So, yeah. As this being my first year in this position, not in education, but in this position, I feel like this is really where I'm supposed to be at. Like, and I know, like, growing up, I always say, oh, I might be a teacher or something like that. And it's proven because... The proof is literally in the pudding. Like 17 out of 19, 
are on grade level now and i'm talking about some of them were actually red if you don't know what red is that means they were well below according to the data or according to modules or tests that they have to take that means that they're well below their grade level and they should be like in a lower grade you know and um yeah a lot of my students were well below some were below <clears throat> and then i have some students who actually went like according to how they should have been like beginning of the year they were red um middle of the year they were yellow now end of the year they're green and some were actually green green blue some were yellow green green you know it just it just makes me feel good because nobody regressed they all made progress and they all did what they were supposed to do and even the ones who are yellow the two that are yellow they were just like steadily yellow so it wasn't like they were yellow and red and you know so it's just an overall good feeling and i don't know better words to come up with or better words to say than just i'm so i don't know i'm so i don't know ecstatic and i love what i do so yeah all that to say the meeting went good and um i got some good feedback and you know some things for the upcoming year um to take in but yeah like i said earlier we are two weeks okay remaining okay and that's it we're moving on starting fresh and things like that so yeah it's actually almost my planning period so what i'm gonna do is just go ahead and um start and put in my data we actually took um probes yesterday and i'm gonna go ahead and put in the data that i have um and then i still have about four or five students i think it's i have four students left that i need to go ahead and um test and then put their data in so yeah i'm gonna just go ahead and get started with my planning and then i'll check back in with you guys a little bit later of today's video i don't have anything planned for the remainder of today but if i'm mistaken i will be sure to pull out my camera and go ahead and vlog it for you guys but yeah i had fun catching up with you guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you did go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and also consider subscribing to my channel i would love to have you guys here until my next video bye